Okay, good morning. I wanted to do an update on the uh, apple trees, and they seem to be doing a lot better. There's a lot of aphids on them. I don't know if you can still see. There's little black specks on that one in the middle. Right here. Um, so I've been spraying them with uh, uh, dish soap and water, um, just so... Um, pretty much everything's covered and I've probably done it about four times these apple trees are definitely looking a lot better um, there's still a few that are probably just dead uh, that they're just crumpled up and not doing so hot so it definitely seems to be working um, I don't know how well it'll work if you know it's raining every day or whatnot um, so yeah it's a good good alternative to use um, Let's see here. And then also, because I have these two sizes of cones. This is a big one. And this is a small one. A couple inches shorter. Um, but I would bet this one is ready to be transplanted. And when I do that, the root system is not going to be so long because um, you've got to be really careful with these longer tubes. Um, usually they have to grow out a little longer, um, you know, a few months longer. Otherwise, it's easy to break or disturb the roots. Um, but I would say these little short ones are super easy to plant and not have any problems with. Um, I've also got the apple trees in the pots, which also have aphids on some of them. Um, but they're actually growing pretty well. Um, I don't know what I'll do with them. I mean, this guy's huge. Um, I was hoping to graft onto some of them, but I don't know if they're big enough yet. So maybe next year. Um, and then I have one apple tree in this air pot, and I don't know if it's gonna make it. Right there. Um, looks like it's getting eaten by something. But, yeah, so I'll transplant some more things today and a few other videos. Oh, and this one in the clover. I need to cut the clover. Look at that thing. Uh, but here's the apple tree right there. It's just getting smothered by everything. So I'll cut that clover down, and I'll probably try and leave it on top of the pot so that it gets some nutrients and covers the soil and whatnot. Um, so those are apple trees for today.